Dasbag is a fortuitous term. When you start a new family, a new business, a new venture, everyone in your family and your friends will say Dasbo, which means you should be fortunate. And culturally, that's we want the company to be culturally attached to where we're from. So we grew up in uh, uh, the former Soviet Union in uh, St. Petersburg. And we left uh, St. Petersburg in 1979. None of us spoke English, so uh, we got an advice on the plane saying, just say yes a lot and smile, and uh, everything will be okay. You know, the roots in Russia really play many different roles. I think what we use our brand and the packaging on the brand and everything that we do as a canvas to tell our story of where we're from, uh, our immigration process, and really to bring in to explain the culture, the Russian culture of hard work. So it, it just translates into the product line and consumers are really taken to it. And then afterwards we really deliver what's inside of the bag. I graduated college uh, at CU Boulder in 92 and wanted to open up a coffee shop and found out that I've got a great palate for beverage. And Tony and I are looking at each other and saying that this is a great industry and this is something that we can do uh, together as a family and provide the best product uh, on the planet and really tell our story through the brand. And we, in May of 96, we started our company. You know, the more we branded our product, the better we saw that our wholesale customers did. And at a certain point, we decided to do a corporate store, which was five years ago. So we've got uh, about 30 stores right now. The coffee itself, we believe that we source uh, the best. I know a lot of people say that, but we really prove it in the cup. So we want to make sure that the Sumatran really represents the best of Sumatra, or some of the sweetness behind a Costa Rican uh, coffee, the brightness of a Guatemalan. We want to make sure that all of those characteristics are brought out in the best light of that origin. And our roasting style tends to uh, bring out the sugars in the coffee. So it's really the, the sweetest coffee and uh, naturally the sweetest coffee that money can buy. One of the biggest comments people say about our coffee is that they don't need cream and sugar with it because it's got a lot of flavor, a lot of the nuances of the different coffees, uh, but it doesn't have any of the bitterness to it. You know, that's the love and the passion that we have for not only uh, the product but for the brand so that people remember it, uh, that it is the best. We tell our story through the brand, so, and then we engage people into have a relationship with us by, if it's a KG plant, people know that's what they drink. They don't just say, I drink Dasbach coffee, I drink actually KG plant. Well, we have a lot of fun with the names, like Russian Roulette, White Knights Espresso, the famous KGB. We want people to relate to us, to our branding, uh, and enjoy the coffee while they're doing it. Like Svoboda, bland uh, means freedom. So when we came to America, that was the, the freedom we were looking for. And so everything has a story behind it. We want people to know who we are and where we're from. We have a tea line that we rolled out in the last couple of years, and it took us a while to do it. Uh, and the same kind of practices goes for the tea as coffee. Source the best and provide the best. So we, right now we have about 30 different selections of loose leaf tea. And make it bold. Make a bold product, uh, just like the coffee. The restaurants uh, have taken it a uh, different approach. What happens is that uh, they realize that the last thing people do in the restaurant after a meal is they have a cup of coffee. And it is very important that that cup of coffee is uh, uh, a, a final touch to the meal and it has to be uh, something people can remember on the positive and we don't want them to feel like they have another me too product and when people come to us whether it's a trade shows or somewhere and they say why is your coffee so different and the biggest response to that question is we're not saying we're, we're different we want you to taste it we want you to become a believer so taste the cup. When we can make people happy, the, it, is, uh, it makes all of us uh, and everything we do is worthwhile. Das Bog. Drink Das Bog. Yeah, we do it as a toast when we say Das Bog. With enough Das Bog, you can do anything. Yeah.